unstoppable out there. How did you feel? Oh, I felt great. Uh, I really needed that one, especially after my first two games. Uh, they shot the ball well from the field the first two, but uh, today my teammates uh, did a great job of finding me, uh, especially in my spots in the post and stuff, and uh, we got a great outcome out of that. And everybody played great, and it was uh, defensive. I thought we were really good. Did you have like what? a conscious effort early on to go to the run? I mean, it just seems like you started, you know, your game inside out. Oh yeah. Uh, to me, uh, after watching the first two games and uh, trying to make it, I was trying to make it work uh, because I wasn't uh, getting ball to my spot. So tonight, uh, my mindset was just to be at the rim, just stay on the block, play in the low zone, and. Uh, 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 he worked out pretty well. It's your first time ever facing Andre Drummond. What did you think about that matchup? Uh, I mean, uh, it was. Uh, it was. I mean, it was good. Uh, I mean, obviously, I had an okay game, uh, but uh, I thought I thought uh, I got what I wanted, uh, and then we got a win. What uh, impressed you the most about the way Ben ran the team down the stretch? I was good, you know, just found the game plan and whatever coach was uh, was calling. I thought we had a great two man game, especially they couldn't they couldn't guard that. So I think going forward, uh, I think that'd be that'd be great. Uh, that'd be great for us to like uh, keep doing the same thing. Did you slide on a wet spot when you went down? Oh yeah, I did. You know, it's only four games and it's still very early, but for this team to get a win, what does that mean? Oh, uh, he's, uh, he's great, you know, especially after the 0-3 start. Uh, uh, I wish I was in Toronto to uh, see what it was going to look like, but uh, I thought the first two games, I thought we, we played and uh, we had a chance of winning those games and we just couldn't close it out. And tonight we closed it out, so I'm pretty happy about it. But it's a long season, and it's going to be up and downs, and we got to be ready and tough mentally to like uh, bounce back. With that said, you've got more than a month till your next back-to-back. -back. Does that make you pretty pleased when you see the schedule and you got some time before? Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's, I think it's going to be good for me. You know, I'm still way behind, um, out of shape, and uh, I didn't get to work out all summer, so I got a lot to learn, especially le uh, uh, learn how to play with my new teammates too. So I think, I think it's going to be good getting the rhythm and uh, just keep playing, and then by... Uh, maybe the next back to back, maybe I'll have a chance to play that one. I know we ask you about this a lot, but what is it about your preparation um, do you think allows you to kind of come in and make an impact the way you do, um, even if you do have some rest and you're not playing as frequently as you might like? Uh, I, actually, I don't know. Uh, I don't understand, no, but uh, you know, when I come in, you know, my job is to be the leader and uh, bring some energy, especially defensively. You know, I want to be the best defender in the league and I want to win defensive player of the year. So that's my job. Just come in, play with energy, pick up on my teammates, and uh, uh, I feel like we do a, a great job. Uh, 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 even when I'm, not, when I'm not out there, I think I play hard and stuff, but I think we have, uh, we play so much harder too. Uh, you know, my job is just to come in and uh, bring some energy and play defense.